Hello, I'm Martin Sure from Kenya. I'm the founder and CEO of Green Farms Limited. I'm also a 2021 Anzisha Fellow. Anzisha is a program by the African Leadership Academy and MasterCard Foundation that focuses in empowering young African entrepreneurs across Africa. So last year, I was lucky enough to be selected among their finalists. It is a very stiff competition. And after the applications, they first shortlisted 150 people. We then had a video interview where the selected 50 entrepreneurs who were then visited to come out with a list of the top 26 2021 finalists. I was excited by the announcement that was made last year, October 2021. And besides that, we've been, it has been a journey to date. So allow me to take you through the journey of my last six months with the Anzisha Fellowship Program. So after the announcement of the top 26 finalists, we were sent for some gifts that a package that had some laptop, some camera, and also some snacks. I was also viewed as one of the greatest things that I treasure. I was awarded a book. I really love books and I really love reading. And I can show you the book. It's a very nice book. <laughs> a very nice book by Abed Tabu. The book is called Searching Through the Dustbin. So we are indeed searching through the dustbins currently. After reading this book, it will transform your life. So after receiving the gifts, we were then requested to prepare for an induction program that went for two weeks. The first two weeks we spent in our offices and the last one week we were booked for a five-star hotel that we spent good moments there. And during the induction period also to mention, we got to be taught a lot about entrepreneurship and about building brands that can last and about how entrepreneurship can actually change the world and how we can actually consider entrepreneurship as a career. So we had amazing programs with the Anzita teams, the likes of Josh. We had the likes of Tokoza, Didi Bonu, Mpundombanse, Tali Moyo. They had great sessions with us and gave us amazing addresses that were focused in making us believe in ourselves and know that it is us, the young entrepreneurs, that can indeed change Africa. So apart from the programs that were venture-based, we also had some fun moments and we were paired into two. We were paired into two and we had 13 teams that participated in a game, Amazing Race. And I was paired with a, 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 a fellow from Zimbabwe, Tafatsa. And we were lucky enough to be the first runners up, that is number two. And it was a great moment with them. And also I can mention that it is during the time that I get to know people, that I get to connect to, different, to several people across Africa. I can now boast that I have two friends in Uganda. I have one friend in Tanzania, Doreles. I have one friend from Malawi. My name is Imati Masia. I have two friends 
from Zimbabwe, Tafazwa and Munya. I have two friends from Madagascar, one friend from South Africa, uh, one friend from Namibia, another friend from Congo, Bakunzi, two friends from Cameroon, Issa and Tabe, four friends from Nigeria, the likes of Grace and Ene, and one friend from Togo, Rebecca, another Nemsi of Rebecca from Sierra Leone, and another friend from Sierra Leone, Amadou. And we got to connect with such great souls. After that, after the end of the program, we had a sales learning week that took place in February. This sales week was a, a very productive moment. It was a moment that we got to learn our weaknesses in sales. We were taught on how to penetrate new markets, on how to build an enduring brand, and also how to survive competition, and which is very common for any business that is around. It is the during the sales week that uh, we got to know some key elements of marketing too, and also how to convince people uh, into our products and how to make our products outstanding in the market. Yeah, and apart from the sales, all along from January, we've been con we were paired with the coaches that help us build our brand, especially the financial aspect, where we get to learn about accounting, about budgeting, about uh, keeping good records, so that as we do business, we also get to have some realistic records and some good records that we can present to other investors and also we can be used to in taxation that are, is very key. So I was given a coach, Ms. Shaila Mhaza, that have, she, we, who is an amazing soul, and also an Adnan that we've been meeting monthly since January. And also, to add on, on 11th May 2021, I got a very great message from Natalie Moore that we were awarded 5,000 worth of Amazon Web Services Activate credits valid for two years and also one year of Amazon Web Services Business Support. This is a program that is aimed at making us have an online presence and improve our digital skills so that our businesses can be transformative and scale up to new markets easily because of technology, which is very epitome in the current business world. Yeah. Uh, to add on, I, was, I also got a great message that I was to be visited by the Anzisha Storytelling team and I had the great opportunity to meet Didi Onu and Fundo Banze, very great people I've never met in this world. They were jovial people, we had great moments with them. We first met in Kisumu, Kisumu is a city in Kenya, it is the third city in Kenya towards the west, just before Uganda. So we met in Kisumu and we went back to my former high school and we addressed the students there and the teachers. The students were really amazed and they were really excited to see me back. We, they were really, really amazed by the fact that young people can get to venture into new entrepreneurship ventures and actually succeed. So after the session we had in Maseno, we went back to my business, which is based in Migori, Kenya. Migori is some distance from Maseno, which is based in Kisumu. And we had a session with my workers and also my family that is also based there. 
and we got a great moment. Fundo had to eat some new foods that he just got there, and it was an adventure for him. And after the session in my business, we went back to Nairobi, where we got to have a session too with a panel discussion with the e-community and also we got to meet other fellows that are, were in the previous cohorts like 2017, 2019 uh, and we got to meet new faces, the people like Impa, Kibet and also Wilfred and we got to share and we got to have a supper after that that we got to, got to meet new people. So it has been a, a life-changing moment where I have been able to scale up my network. I've been able to learn about accounting that I had no knowledge about. It is a moment that I've been able to be energized and believe in myself and pursue an entrepreneurship as a full-time job. And it is indeed a great moment that every African youth may want to actually engage in. And it is a great moment and I thank, I really thank the Anzisha team for being this amazing. Thank you guys.